So now I'll show the client push installation method. To perform the client push installation method, first thing open the console manager, configuration manager. In administration, we get a site configuration. Under site configuration, we get the sites are available. So here we got the hierarchy settings are available. So the site settings. So use the fallback site, this one and client approval and conflict in the records so by default be enabled and automatic client upgrade so upgrade the client software so click ok so click ok so next point select the sites so here you can able to find out the settings settings are available so in these settings we get the client installation settings are available. In the client installation settings, now we can able to find out client push installation. So enable automatic site wide client push installation for all my servers, for workstations and configuration manager site system servers and always install the configuration manager client on domain controllers also. Now who has the permissions to install the client software now? So click on the accounts. So click on this yellow color symbol here to add the accounts. So we have the new account here. Click on browse advanced and find now so select username as administrator or manually you can type it a domain name slash administrator and type the password administrator password Now click on the verify here. So it asks me about data sh shows network share. So where this client software is available now. So click on browse. So in this folder here you can type it as a double slash my server under this. We can able to find out a site code SMS India. So in this we can able to find out the client software. So select the folder. So click on the test connection. The connection was successfully verified. So click OK and click on apply. See in the installation properties, it displays the site code, SMS site code and you want to provide like your fallback status point of also, you can type it as FSP and my server. So it is apply and OK. Then how to perform the client installation in the client side now? So click on the SSN compliance, go for devices collections, so you got all the systems are available now. So there is the option name you can install client. If you want to install the client software for all the systems at the same time, say install client or you go for it, say all systems. So select a particular system you want to install the client software. So right click here. So simply say install client. So go for next. 
always install the client software and the site name to make it so go for next and click next so click on close now if open the task manager here now the CSM setup file is running here so this is one of the easiest way to install the client software so after performing the client installation here if open the control panel you will get the same icon configuration manager icon is available now and if open the configuration manager now so still it is installing so wait for some time so now open the control panel so large icons or small icons so they regard a separate icon is available is a configuration manager icon see in the components so all these components are installed so in the actions so everything is okay now see by default the site will be India site and you want to find out the site if not necessary it will automatically configure and you want to perform any other actions manually you can perform this one like you want to get the immediately the options you want to perform it we can run it otherwise not necessary still this policy is not updated so now it is ok so close it only for testing whether the software is installing or not we have to open the task manager is not necessary to open the task manager so in the control panel like in the all programs in system center 2012 we can find out a separate one software center the software center using for to deploy the applications like what are the software are available software to install the installation status whether installed or not and installed softwares and options so the business hours so 5 am to 10 pm i am configuring as a business hours is by default information and sunday is a holiday like this way and saturdays and the power management options and the computer maintenance and remote control so close now if open the configuration manager console so still you got for my server you got like a none is available so just you can go for refresh it once device collections all systems so now we got for my server also you can say yes so in this way we can able to install the client softwares so before step we have seen manual installation of the client software and next point the client push installation method and the most of the cases point of view the easiest way client push installation method is easiest way